Hi there and welcome back to Fallout 3. I'm Byron. And since we are quite close to Arafu, we're going to go there now. Just you know, we were not going to do the whole quest. Just a quick visit to get another bubble head. Oh wait. Who wants to fuck with me? Oh, you. Bullet to the head. Exactly. What? Oh! Oh! And now you. Oh, 29% is not really much. Exactly. I have discovered Kalen's bed and breakfast. Ow! There seems to be another one. Ow! How can I get up here? I don't have to, you come down. That's cool, I guess. There should be a way to get up there. Oh, there's another one. Gotta be kidding me! Fucking raiders! Can you hit a moving target? Well, oh, she's not too ugly. Oh well. Now we. She's pretty useless now. Wait, does she have hands on her belt? You gotta be kidding me, girl! You are one twisted fuck! Uh, how do I get up? Oh! What the fuck? Oh, I hear. This is the way to get up there. Hey. Turn on the light, I can't see shit. Hi, you still dead? Yep. I hope I'm not um, crippled or anything. <coughs> Okay, so I wanted to go into this direction. And there's another one. Up or down? Probably down here. There she is. You should. You shouldn't turn your back on me, girl. I would shoot you in the back. Oh, combat shotgun. Oh! What? Oh! You gotta Ow. be kidding me. What was that? Well, that's a headshot if I ever saw one. It's not too funny to be on the receiving end of one. Sam Warwick, why the fuck do you attack me? And who the hell are you? What, what's your gun? It's a sniper rifle. If 
fine. We need something with more power. Like that. Sam Warwick. I don't know you. Why did you attack me again? Ooh, dang it. I have too much things. Too many things, actually. But then again, you know. I should drop something. For instance, the leather armor. I wanted to go to Arafu before I was distracted. Oh yeah, it's up to that bridge here. Wait. Where was Caden's bed and breakfast? What's that? It's just that house here? The remains of that house? That's it. That ain't much though. Okay. Fine. Forget it. we have here? Rotting Brahmin corpse. How many eyes do you have? Are those eyes too? <gasps> ah, it's a fucking scorpion. How about I shoot that bloody sting off? Boom. Feeling happy now? Punk. Hi. Hey. Hang on, you're not one of them. I nearly blasted you in two. Get over here before they spot you. Careful where you point that thing at. Now what the hell are you doing all the way out here? Well, I have this little for letter for the West family. That's great, but I got bigger problems than being the town post office right now. The shit's about to hit the fan in this cesspool, and I don't think I can stop them. Mm. Are they raiders or slavers? No way. If they were, you'd be staring at a burned-out ghost town. I think the family are just a bunch of punks. Well, at first, they do typical gang bullshit. You know, break stuff and make lots of noise. But they always kept their distance. But this last time, they went too far. They killed all of our Brahmin. I mean, that's our life blood out here, you know? Mm, what's got you so spooked? Ah, look, you can call me crazy if you want. But there is something odd about those creeps. I mean, they got the guns and they got the muscle. Why don't they just bust down our doors and take us out already? We're really in a bad way and could use some help. Um... I'd be glad to help. What do you need? I don't want to take my eyes off the ramp here. There's no telling when the family will return. Can you do me a favor and check on the other people's houses here? You know, make sure they're doing okay? 
Speak with Davis West, Karen Shenzi, and Ken Ewers. I have a message for the West family from their daughter. I can't take that. You're just going to have to bring it to the West yourself. Can you tell me more about what's been going on around here? There used to be more families living here. Most of them have dismantled their shacks and moved on to greener pastures. Those that are still living here are keeping themselves indoors, thanks to the family. Mm, where do you think I can find the family? I think they live somewhere east or northeast of here. Problem is, they always travel in the dark, so I can't see exactly where they go. There's all kinds of places they could be hiding, like Hamilton's Hideaway, the old Moonbeam Cinema, or Northwest Seneca Metro Station. I have to go now. Just watch yourself. I've got an itchy trigger finger. Yeah, I already saw that. Knock on the door. Hello? Is this the mailman? Oh, I do hope my fall catalog has arrived. Sure, yeah, I have your fall catalog. Oh, goody. I can hardly wait to browse the latest fashions. Please do come inside. Let me unlock the door for you. Yeah, I'm just the postman delivering your uh, the catalog. What the hell are you doing in here? Get the fuck out! Your wife let me in. Uh, something about a catalog. Oh, for the love of... Look, she's dumber than a bag of hammers, okay? If you want to talk to anyone, you need to talk to me. So what the fuck do you want? Ewing Hing told me to check on you. Is everything okay? We're great. Just peachy. I love sitting in my house with my thumb up my ass. Tell Mr. King that sitting here all day isn't going to make us any safer. We need to take action. So what's your take on Evan King? Well, he's town mayor or sheriff or whatever he calls himself. He calls all the shots. When he says to get the heck indoors and stay put, we do that. Mm, can you tell me more about what's been going on around here? Everyone is keeping themselves safe from the family. If I was you, I'd do the same. You want to know more? Talk to Evan King. Hmm, what do you think about the family? They're low-life scum who decided to use Arafu as their own personal amusement park. Oh, they're a fun bunch. I'd take a shot at them if I could, but judging from what they did to the Brahmin, I wouldn't live long to tell about it. I have to go. Good. Now get out. So what do you have to add? Hey, you must be exhausted from all that walking in this horrible heat. Oh, and hungry too. Sit, please. Braley Ewers is the name. Don't mind my husband, Kenneth. He woke up on the wrong side of the bed this morning. Evening Hing told me to check on you. Is everything okay? Oh, he's such a dear. I must remember to make more of those preserves he loves so much. Can you tell me more about what's been going on around here? Oh my, I don't know. Mrs. West is probably whipping up a batch of her famous cookies. And all the kids are playing in the yards. Oh, fun. It's so nice outside. The grass looks lovely this time of year. She surely lives in her own world. Uh, yeah. <laughs> wow, are you batshit insane or what? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's quite lovely. Um, I've got to go. Oh, certainly. Close the front gate when you leave and mind my begonia garden. I just planted them. Oh, well. She really is badgered insane, but it would be impolite to tell her that. Yes. Who is it? Well, even King sent me. Can I come in? Oh, he did? Well, it's about damn time he did something. Come on in. I'll unlock the door. It's nice to see a friendly new face around here. It's been a long time. The name's Karen Shenzi. Evan King told me to check on you. Is everything okay? Scared out of my mind. I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever. So what's your take on Evan King? He's a spineless wimp. His best solution to the family is to stay inside our homes and hide. What does that tell them? It tells them that we can be pushed around whenever they want. I'm sick of it. And I'm sick of King. 
Can you tell me more about what's been going on around here? We're scared shitless. Evan King's got everyone so worked up about the family, no one wants to set foot outside. That asshole runs the show. But does he really do anything about our problem? No. What do you think about the family? All they do is terrorize us. They taunt us to open our doors, throw bottles at our houses, and scream at us. If I knew King had my back, I'd step outside and show them just how I feel about their visits. Especially after this last attack. Sure, go. Just like everyone else. Don't worry, I'll be coming back. And here we do have Evan King's house. He shouldn't see us. So we break our way in here. Turn on the fucking light. Because here is the bubble head repair. You found the Voltec limited edition bubble head. The inscription on the base reads, why go down with the ship when you can try to fix it? Your repair skill has been permanently increased by 10 points. Yay. Um, and I guess that's all we need in here. Ammo. May I always take ammo? Sorry, we do karma here, but I guess that's worth it. Wow, he has a lot of ammo. That's it, I guess. Where is the exit? Oh, here. Environment suit gives us a plus five to medicine. Let's see what the, whether that does us any good. Shit. The bodies of the West have bite marks on the neck area that go to the bone. There's nothing else on the corpse to indicate what happened. Sexy sleepwear. Charisma plus one. Hmm. So I guess we can sleep here for one hour. And I'll uh, fully healed again. Whoa. That's not supposed to be like that, is it? Okay, nothing new here. Is everyone okay? What did they tell you? Everyone okay? Mm, did you know the Wests are dead? The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. Wait a minute. When you searched the Wests' place, did you find their son Ian's body? No, I only found uh, the parents buddies this has to be the work of the family I've caught that weirdo leader of theirs <coughs> talking to Ian down by the river look I know I've asked a lot of you already but you have to find that kid he deserves better than all this mmm don't worry even I'll figure out what happened to the rests oh I have a message hmm. yeah, I guess he wouldn't take it would he I can't take that you're just going to have to bring it back to Lucy or to Ian if you can find him. Don't worry, Ian. I will figure out what happened to the Wests. Thanks, kid. You're all right. The Wests had bite marks on their necks. Mean anything to you? Bite marks on their necks? That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. The family must have attack dogs with them or something. Oh, this is all I needed right now. What am I going to do? They'll keep coming back until all of us are dead. No, they're not. Next time I see the family, there's going to be hell to pay. Okay, 
yeah, so we have to um, locate the family, but we will do that quest now again. Um, so we should go to the Tepid Sewers, but I guess before we do that, we return to Megaton. What time what? is it? Hmm. Something? No, everything is just dandy. I guess we could sell stuff. I have a few more bubble heads. Mm, very nice. So, I think we could take, for instance, this one, and we don't need all those jumps uh, suits anymore. Science plus five. Okay. It's almost in perfect condition now. Where is my sniper rifle? Oh, here it is. Um, what kind of ammo does it use? Three oh eight. Where's my robot? Oh, here. Good evening, sir. What are you doing on the what stairs? What can I do? I'm sorry, sir. My con. Fine. Do you know a joke? A neutron walks into a bar. How much for a drink here, anyway? To which the bartender responds, uh, for you, no charge. <laughs> I think we already had that. Let me get rid of all my radiation. And sleep till the shops open. Uh, that should be like four hours. <coughs> Very well. What are you doing here? Get your ass off the stairs. I can't wait. Uh, wait. Didn't she have more the last time? 500 or something? Shit. Where's your money, girl? I guess her inventory reset it. Ah. Oh, I'm not using the roving trader outfit right now, it doesn't matter. So, I guess we could use some ammo. Combat helmet. That's cool. Good hunting. Ah, 
Not ice combat helmet. And we leave again. Oh yeah, of course I have um, scrap metal. Gramps, you in here? Yes. What do you need? Guess what? Are you serious? Thank you. And bye. Okay. So we should head into this direction. What's that? Great Edge Sewer Waste Station. Let's go to the Sewer Waste Station. What? What's that? That can't be fun. I don't like those guys. Well now, if it isn't the little saint from the vault. We've been looking for you. Someone's put quite a price on your head. When do you mean to collect? You think you can walk around the wasteland doing the things that you do and there isn't going to be someone who takes notice? Such a shame. I hear that you could have been something useful. Ah well. Time to die. Hmm. Well, what are you waiting for? Ha! I love it when they go down fighting. So, how about I shoot your fucking head off? Exactly. This one's head on. This one's head on. Fuck you. You were saying? Ha. Oh, we got a contract. Hmm, let's read that. Kill Gottfried. Boys and girls, we've got ourselves another holier-than-thou white knight needs putting down. Here are the details. Name, Gottfried. Race, Caucasian. Sex, male. Sex, yes, plenty. <laughs> the bounty is 10,000, uh, 1,000 caps this time around, and for a change of pace, they want the head this time. Good hunting. Yeah, well, that didn't work out, did it? <laughs> I guess we can repair our combat armor now. <clears throat> so, how about we go in here? Turn on the light. What do we get? Hmm, nothing really. Oh, scrap metal. At least, wait, what's that? Scissors. Mm. Oh, you got Cola Quantum. Oh. What the fuck? You. Sneaking up on me. See? Now you're dead. What's what's that? Money. Sugar bombs. Hmm, that looks nicely. Looks nice actually. Uh, oh wait, a, a teddy with whiskey. Hey, wait. Are you French kissing him or her or whatever? Uh, I will not disturb you. Oh, red roach. How about we slice you up? Ow. There are more. Yes, there are. So I guess that's a way to go down here. Lead pipe. 
put it away. Ball to Greatage. Now we're graded. No, not really. Where was the water dispenser? So what do we get here? That's a ghoul. Ghoulie ghoul. Dead. Hey. You were killing that. Oh, he's a bowie pen. That's cool. I take it. I take everything. And another one. Okay. Shit. Yeah, if something falls down, you better run. Because, uh, yeah, here's a tripwire. I didn't see that. I'm very sorry. So what else do we have here? Pressure plate, disarm the treasure pressure the treasure plate, yeah the pressure plate. What do we get here? Great. <coughs> That's Shotgun shells, leaf blower, red axe, heating stuff, shotgun shells. Ten millimeter rounds. Yes, that's it. Mission. Hmm. It's nothing with an ink. It's not lantern either. Oh, it was hanging this time. Okay. Um, disengage lock. I don't want to disengage the lock. Oh, <coughs> wow. Ew, that's Gallo. He doesn't seem to be friendly. So he blow his head off. Take all. And now I hack you. Uh, I'll rather pick you. Look, I call a quantum. Okay. Strange pets do you have? And you eat ghoul, is that right? Blech. Strange meat, I guess I don't want to eat that. What's in here? Nothing that I need. What do you have here? Nuka Cola trucks, pre war books, empty Nuka Cola, and a foot locker. Oh, a storage key and shotgun shells. 
Hmm, I guess we don't really need it. You cannot sleep when while enemies are nearby. Where are enemies? Okay, I guess that what's on the desk? I guess that's pretty much all. Yep, yeah, looks like it. I guess that's where we came from. That's a dead end, so this is where we have to go. And we will do that. Oh, what's that? Ammo, yay. We will do that in the next video. So, thank you very much for watching, and see you soon. Bye.